What's up, wrestling fans? It's Devin Rucker. It's Spooky. And we are your dudes talking wrestling. First and foremost... <laughs> Great job, Squared Circle Shenanigans. You finally cut a promo. Well, you had somebody cut a promo. Yeah, they, they couldn't do the job themselves, so they had to get Jeremiah Goldstein to come on in, sniff them out. You're telling me that they brought in the man that looks like a walking whippet to cut a promo on us? I didn't say it, you did. Well, yeah, go ahead. The guy says, we don't have to pre-record, we can go live. And then he says, the sky is green. I don't know what type of dabs you're taking over there at the Brain Jerk Studios, Mm. but you might want to tone it down a little bit. And what's really funny, Spook, Mm. this guy calls himself the 24 Carat. I don't even know, but he has to create his own wrestling promotion because when's the last time that he wrestled up? A relevant match in any other promotion. I mean, I can't think of him when I film him. He's not on camera. I'm just saying. And now, no. he's, now he's the manager of Tweedledee and Tweedledum. I'm just shocked that, you know, he even had to open up his mouth. I mean, he's he looks like a broken broomstick. <laughs> so it is what he looks like. So missing a couple straws there. And the funniest <laughs> thing is he, he gave you your flowers. Spooky, spooky. But then he wanted to disrespect you and say spooky. Right. Wants to rebuttal that. So, But that was the first thing that he said. He's one of the greatest video I got. Do you like us or not, buddy? Because I don't know what you think you're going to do. Seems like he was a little forced. He was a little pressed. You Pre- know, they were, they, were, they were trying to sandwich him in there. Pressed is an understatement. They were <laughs> squishing him. You said it, I didn't. And it's funny because we do work together. Yeah, they just bit. had the Big Boys of Comedy Tour, and who hosted that? I think you did. That I did. And the opener, the redheaded stepchild that they call Scotty, yeah, uh, he wants to end it with taking his shirt off and rubbing his titties in some lady's face. I feel bad for Jet Thought. Right, I mean, come on now. He's probably going to have the health department there. Booty crack was all out. These are the guys that think they can hold our jock straps when it comes to podcast or even talking wrestling. I don't think so, man. I don't think so at all. 